Hello boys and girls, this is Fog, and you are looking at my fully automated 1.5 friendly fried chicken farm. This little device will continually create fried chicken for as long as you keep fuel in the box. In this case I'm using blaze rods for fuel, but you can use pretty much anything that will burn in a furnace. And let me quick walk you through some of the features. Up here we have the egg hatchery. These chickens up here lay eggs which get sucked into this hopper and fired down onto that slab there. The chicks slowly grow over time. 20 minutes after an egg hatches it grows into a full-size chicken and because there is not enough room for a full-size chicken the machine smothers it. At which point the chicken and feathers drop into this hopper here and into this box. The feathers stay in the box, the chicken gets pulled out into the furnace, and then it is cooked, and down here you have instant fried chicken. This machine has a 3x4x12 volume. Uh, I am not counting the two note blocks there, as they are an optional accessory. So it's very easy to build, it is light on materials, and for those of you that like materials lists, here you go. Everything in the top two rows is required to build it. You also need, of course, a source of chicken eggs, and you need something to use as fuel. These things down here are optional accessories. All right. Now that you've seen it, would you like to build it? So let's start building it. First thing we need to build is we come down here and we're going to build the fry cooker and the way we do that is we place a chest to take our to uh, hold our fried chicken and we're gonna put a hopper into the chest we're gonna put a furnace above the hopper we're gonna put a hopper in the front of the furnace we're gonna put a chest on top of that hopper whoops do it this way not that it matters and then we're gonna put two hoppers back here one above the other like that then we take any solid blocks we like we put two of them there right beside the lower hopper above the furnace there and we're gonna put a redstone torch right there that is the only redstone torch in the entire build put another block back here come up here we're gonna put two redstone right there that is the only redstone in the build we're gonna put a redstone comparator there and we're going to put another solid block here. Now, as an option, you may want to use, instead of a solid block there, you may want to use some glowstone. You don't have to, but uh, it's a nice way to go. It means that you've got something providing light down there so that nothing will spawn there. But, you know, you can go either way. All right, now what we have down here is we have a filter. We're going to put a chest on top of all this as well, right there. And... Right now we need to finish off this filter so that only raw chicken will get pulled down into our oven. And the way we do that is in the lower hopper we're going to put four of any kind of block there we like and then 64 raw chicken in the first slot. That won't go down because this torch is disabling that hopper. Then above it we're going to put 22 chicken, four there and 18 there. Now we're in a situation where if we put anything up here that isn't raw chicken it'll stay in the chest but if we put raw chicken in there it will pull it down and put it right down there into the furnace we need to put our our fuel of choice here in our fuel chest and that will funnel down into our oven and now when we put when we put fry, uh, raw chicken in the chest it will get pulled down into the oven and fry up automatically and when it's done get deposited in that chest there. So there's our cooker. Now we need to build our chicken hatchery and slaughterhouse. So let's start this way. We're gonna put a hopper right above it and then what we're gonna do is we're going to build up a couple of here and we're gonna put a dispenser facing down right there right above the top just like that then we're gonna put a slab right there on top of the hopper 
and we're going to surround that with glass like this. At this level, on one of these, we're going to put a redstone block, and over the other three, we're going to put a solid block. And now out the back here, you're going to put a block of some sort. I like to use a slab, but it doesn't need to be a top slab. It can be anything. And then you put a comparator there. Now you've got a hopper set to automatically fire eggs down onto this slab there. This is where the chicks are going to be deposited. They're going to grow up and smother and fall down into that hopper. Now, it's very important that this be built exactly like this. Don't try and put this comparator there. Don't do this, for example. Don't go. Don't do that. If you do that, then your chicks down here uh, will not stay standing right in the middle of that slab. They may decide to wander around. And if they move at all, then you're going to have uh, dead chicken parts all over the place. And it's a real disaster. So resist the urge to do that, please. So there we have our little slaughter area. Now we're going to build our our hatchery, our, our egg producer. So we're going to go ahead and build some glass up around here. Oops, sorry. Put a solid block there with a lever on it. And the reason we're going to do that is now we have a way to disable that hopper. And if we disable the hopper, then we can collect eggs instead of having them fall down into, into the dispenser there. But on the other side, put your glass, and then we put a slab right there over that hopper. We're going to build some glass up like this. Whoops, sorry. Put a solid block there, and some sort of temporary block here. We're going to put another dispenser above that facing down, like, like that and put a slab, that's not a dispenser, that's an oven. Let's get a dispenser. Right there. There we are. So you have bottom slab, top slab, dispenser. Just like that. Surround that with glass. Put a comparator there. And put a lever on the front, turn it on. There you go. Your machine is done. Now all you have to do is feed eggs into it. Like this. If you've done it correctly, this will fire eggs straight down onto that slab. The eggs will break on the top slab. The chicks will fall right down into the middle of the other of the bottom slab and they will stand exactly in the center there, which means that they will grow up exactly in the center there, and any eggs that they drop will fall directly down into the hopper below. Now you need to be really careful not to just do anything that might disturb those chickens, or you're going to have a big chicken mess. So, be warned. At this point, you're basically done. You probably want to do this about three times. Fill this guy with eggs about three times, and that should get you roughly in the neighborhood of 100 chickens there, which is plenty to get a nice constant stream of fried chicken going. But, you know, suit, suit to taste there. You don't need to do any more if you don't want to. It's entirely up to you. Then if you're looking for op optional accessories, come down here, put a note block there and a note block right there. Pick a couple of tones, and now whenever a piece of raw chicken gets fed through the machine, like this, you'll hear a little tone, a little chime. You can also add, if you'd like, you can add a redstone lamp right here works right there works either way either there or down below it like that either way 
and that lamp will flash off whenever chicken goes through the machine. Well, I hope you enjoyed it. And if you did, please hit that like button. It helps people find my videos. If you like what you see here and you want to see more, go ahead and subscribe. I do things like this on occasion. And I also have a Let's Play that you might enjoy. Anyhow, thanks for watching. And I will talk to you all again next time.